An Orange County woman is recovering from her bout with COVID-19, and CBS 2's Rachel Kim explains an experimental treatment at UCLA Health may have been key. But I was just so tired. Yeah. I was just sleeping and didn't even realize how sick, how tired. I mean, I, I literally just slept constantly. 55-year-old Samantha Mote from Seal Beach says around mid-March, she wasn't eating or drinking and had a fever. But the extreme fatigue is what she remembers most from having coronavirus. Just over a week after testing positive, she was checked into UCLA Medical Center. My husband said that I had been, you know, vomiting and having diarrhea. And I didn't even realize. I mean, that whole week, it's just a complete blur to me. Samantha was on a ventilator in the ICU where they tried two treatments that didn't work. That's when her doctor and family approached Dr. Otto Yang. He's a professor of medicine at UCLA's David Geffen School of Medicine, where he's leading a clinical trial of a drug called Laronlamab. Researchers are now administering this to coronavirus patients across the country as a potential new treatment for COVID-19. Dr. Yang offered Samantha a spot in getting the experimental treatment. So it's administered by an injection under the skin. Dr. Yang says Laronlamab is an artificial antibody that works against the second phase of COVID-19. That's when the body's immune system overreacts in response to the virus. That reaction causes a lot of collateral damage. So a lot of the inflammation in the lungs that causes people not to be able to breathe is this collateral damage. So the idea is that it will reduce the amount of inflammation in the lungs. Dr. Yang tells us at this point they can't know for sure whether Laron Lamab is responsible for Samantha's recovery, but he believes there's strong evidence. Within about 24 hours, she started uh, uh, requiring less oxygen on a ventilator. Uh, another 24 hours after that, or actually another 48 hours after that, uh, she was able to come off the ventilator altogether. And then another couple of days after that, she didn't require any oxygen at all. Patients who've gotten the shots in other states have shown strong results. Laron Lamab is in the process of getting FDA approval to treat HIV. Researchers hope it will also soon prove to help reduce coronavirus deaths and prevent infection. Samantha believes Laron Lamab is the reason she's going home from the hospital today. This coronavirus did really knock me down, but the drug in my opinion, has done a wonderful job bringing me back. Rachel Kim, CBS 2 News.